Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to see uh, what is a event parity generator. These parity generators are used in the security systems or uh, data securities, which is used to verify the whether the in transmitted information and the receiver information are same or not, whether there are any errors on there or not. These are all going to be checked using this parity. So let in this video we will see how to design a event parity generator so before that uh, we will write the truth table uh, i will take the uh, four inputs a b c d and i am writing here even parity even right so what are the possible combinations 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 0 0 1 0 0 0 double 1 0 1 double 0 0 1 0 1 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 1 1 triple 0 1 triple 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 double 1 double 0 double 1 0 1 triple 1 0 and finally 1 1 1 1 here the even parity will be decided the based on the number of the ones present in the input here if you observe that if there are any numbers are there zero so even parity also zero here number of ones how many number of ones are there one one is hard number right we have to generate the even parity so we have to add one so this entire data will be it consists of even number of ones and here same one here you can observe that here two number of ones two number of ones means it is a even so we have to add zero in this way we will add the entire parity 0 0 1 1 0 in this way the parity will be designed so in order to uh, establish this function we will require a three XOR gates 1 XOR 2 XOR gate and 3 x circuit here what are the inputs a b c d here this uh, output and the this x output will be given given to this and final output will be come okay here you can observe that suppose if we give the 0 0 double 0 0 1 means 0 0 0 1 what will the, what is the required output we have to opt in one right let us verify whether it is coming or not here zero zero if uh, the input of the xor are both same then the output is zero yet uh, different right so output will be one so here zero and the one the output will be one so we obtained now let us verify this example double zero double one now double zero double one here both are same input so 0 here both are same input so 0 so both the same inputs are applied to the executor again the output will be 0 here the double zero double one the output is 0 so in this way the functionality is verified using this now let us start making the Weller code for this event parity generated ok now let us start making the Weller code for the even parity generator. So for that I am creating the module with the name called even parity and we require a four inputs inputs a comma b comma c comma d and we require one output y. I'm closing this I am just assigning the uh, fu functionality y equal to uh, for all the input four bits we have to perform the XOR operation so AXOR BXOR CXOR B and I will going to EFG comma H yes I am going to represent the, all the inputs with respect to the parity so say uh, e equal to a 
saying f equal to b and then g equal to c and say h equal to b yes this is the module and module and this is the reason code for our even parity now let us write the attachment for module module db register what are the inputs a comma b comma c comma d and what are the outputs wire y comma comma f comma g comma h and uh, even parity right you have to extract all the inputs and the outputs from the design code even parity one a comma b comma c comma d comma e comma f comma g comma h and also y Now I am going to give the test bench initial begin and I am going to give the monitor command monitor now let us verify p equal to first type p comma g equal to percent p equal to percentage b e f f right f equal to percentage b and finally y equal to percentage b and i am writing all this e comma f comma g comma h comma y okay now i am giving the inputs we we have the Four bit input, right? Here we have to give that a equal to zero, b equal to zero, c equal to zero, and d equal to zero. And as for which is nothing but the delay. As this will be sufficient to verify this functionality. Now I am stopping this dollar finish. And and module. So this is the test bench code for our even parity generator. So I am selecting the tool. I am going to save this file and I am giving I'm going to run this. I am giving the name event parity generator right. I am again saving this file I will run this yes here you can observe that here all the inputs are zeros so the output will be zero here there is only a one number right if there is only one is present so the parity is also one so in this way uh, the event parity generator is is created using the Verilog code thank you for watching this video if you have any doubts you can please mention in the comment section you can also see this code in the github link provided in the description and stay tuned for the next video